Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thanks for clicking on today's video. So today I'm going to be showing you my fall and winter coats. Um, some of these I have purchased like years back and then others I've purchased like recently. So I'm going to try to find some similar ones and I'll link them down below. I always take the time to link everything or something similar down below. So check out the description bar. If you're new, hi, I make new videos every Monday, Wednesdays and Saturdays. <laughs> On my lips, I've got the uh, Marc Jacobs Eau Coco Lip Liner it's with... Thank you. Got um, Cool Girl by Too Faced, the liquid matte lipstick. And then I've just got some lip balm on top. Um, these earrings here are from Go Jane. My watch is MVMT. This is the Weathered Beige. You can always get $15 off with the code SEAMS15. Um, my Ellipse Bangle, this is the thin one. I've slept with these bracelets on. I've gotten water spilled on these bracelets on. They've been fine. They haven't rusted or anything like that. So I love the quality of MVMT. Again, SEAMS15, get $15 off your purchase. Um, but yeah, let's just get straight into the video. So if you've been on my channel for a while and you're an OG subscriber, um, I hate that word subscriber. I just, I don't want to call you guys subscribers or followers. I just want to call you my friends. So if you're an OG friend, then you know that I, um, got this like years back. I've, I wore it in my like how to be polished video and this and that. I've worn this leather jacket so much. You've seen it before on my channel. This is by Zara. It's their Trafolic outerwear. I personally love their TRF or Trafolic um, line. I think everyone needs a leather jacket. It's got zip details on the sleeves. Um, but yeah, it's just got a really good fit. So if you're looking for like a new leather jacket, I would highly recommend checking out Zara. This thing always jingles and it gets annoying, but I guess it's like part of the moto look. Obviously getting yourself a leather jacket is so versatile for the fall and winter season. I'm wearing it right now with a pair of Levi's and a black t-shirt as well as a black dress. Um, but you can obviously wear these when you're traveling with joggers or with um, that athleisure wear with joggers and a sweater. And you can wear this so many different ways. You can go on Pinterest and look for um, leather jacket outfo outfit inspo. Um, so yeah, this is my first jacket. I wanted to mention that throughout this video, I'm wearing two different outfits underneath all of these coats. So the first one is the one I'm wearing right now, the black t-shirt v-neck from Zara, these Levi jeans. I also wanted to mention these shoes that I'm wearing the entire video you guys I'm obsessed obsessed like beyond obsessed with these shoes these leather like slides but they've got like a short little heel it's also from go Jane the same place I got these earrings and some of my jackets so make sure you guys check out go Jane really cute stuff on their website if you search really well you guys are all living in different weather climates I've been in Michigan before where it's snowed like crazy and I've been in sunny Los Angeles where it's been like 80 degrees in winter too so I have a really good array of jackets. The next one that I wanted to show you is this like short trench um, coat. So this is from Zara as well. I find that Zara makes really amazing outerwear. Um, this is part of the just the basic um, outerwear department line. This was in a size large. By the way, my leather jacket was in a size medium. I know that they don't have this anymore, but I'll try my best to link something really similar down below. But I find that a short trench coat is really cute for when you're wearing it with leather leggings or black jeans or anything, like any day that you want something that's a little bit lighter than, you know, a leather jacket or one of your other just like zip ups and you want something a little bit more dressed up. I find that I've reached for this jacket here so often. As you can see, it goes so well with a pair of jeans. You could really wear this with anything, but I definitely think it gives a polished look. It's definitely for that girl who's very classic style, polished. You know, I think with an under the arm bag would be really, really cute. So yeah, love this piece to death. Um, again, I'll try my best to find something similar, but if I can't, um, I think a large trench coat too is definitely a must have for fall. So this is the next piece. It's from H&M. It's in a size eight. It's like this waterfall coat almost, but it's really thin, but because it's suede, it's still really warm. Again, I'll try my best to find something similar, but um, when you're looking for something like this, you just wanna look up like waterfall coat or like waterfall lapels um, because it's got like this just waterfall effect lapel, um, which I'm obsessed with. Again, like a coat like this is such a staple because you can wear it with leggings, you could wear it with jeans, with a dress, anything. I think you can easily dress this piece up and down. Um, again, one of my staples for fall. Yeah, I would definitely recommend 
one of these jackets for your fall wardrobe. I did get this like a couple of years ago too. Moving along with a piece that I would never really normally pick, um, it's this houndstooth blazer. And if you know me, I don't really wear any blazers. I love how other girls look in blazers, especially girls with like a flatter chest. Um, and I'm not saying that if you have a larger chest, you can't wear blazers, but I find personally when you have a larger chest, uh, it's, it just, the look of a blazer, it doesn't fit around like my bust area that's well. And especially a boyfriend size blazer makes me look very just bigger than I need to. So I found this at Go Jane, black and white houndstooth blazer. I cuffed it up on the sleeve. The fit is actually so nice for me. I'm right in between a small and a medium normally. This blazer here is in a size medium. I'm a pretty much a small around, but my chest needs to fit a medium. So I find that this blazer fits me really well. It's a great length, kind of got a boyfriend's fit, but the shoulders here are so fitted and I love the way I look in this. It's my sister's birthday dinner tonight, so I think I might be wearing this because I think it's such a cute piece with a pair of jeans. Okay, so I'm so excited about the next piece because it's one that I've had in my closet for years and years and years and it just shows that once you invest in a really nice piece, you can wear it over and over again when the fall or winter season comes. And it's this piece here. Um, my boyfriend got it for me. I told you guys that in my 2018 fall trends video, um, but it's this Topshop cape. And as you can see, you can style it so many different ways. You can wear this as a dress as well if you do it right and then you just fasten it with a brooch or something. But I love this piece so much. It's so classy. I don't, I don't really like wearing really loud over the top colors like bright reds and yellows unless it's like spring or summer. Um, and for the fall, I think a dark olive green, this hunter green, is just a beautiful piece. It reminds me of my old school uniform, this colorway, really versatile piece. Uh, I highly recommend checking out more capes if your guys' weather permits it. My end goal is to get the Burberry cape, um, the one that SJP or Olivia, Pal Olivia Palermo always wears, the one with her initials on it. I would love to get one of those with my initials on it. Um, but for now, I think this is a really great dupe. So if you know me, you know I love denim. I love my denim jackets. I love my denim jeans. I love denim anything. And last year, I purchased this Levi's um, shearling denim jacket. You guys, I think a jacket like this is just so such a staple to anybody's wardrobe, whether you're a girl or a guy, because you can wear it with a hoodie underneath. It's so incredibly warm. You'd be so surprised as to how nice this is to wear in Los Angeles weather. This is like the perfect fall and winter piece because um, it's just gonna keep you warm and it's not super, super bulky. Um, it's got great fit. It's not too long and it's not too short, which I love. And I just love this piece so much. I bought it in a size medium. Again, I've thrown this in the wash hundreds of times. It's been perfectly fine. Love this trend of wearing denim on denim. Not everybody's favorite, but personally, I really like the look of it. If you had to invest in one piece of this whole video, I would say a denim shearling jacket. Again, like it's just one of those pieces that I know you guys will get a lot of wear out of because denim jackets are just so easy to style up. And I actually got mine at a Levi's outlet store for like 70 bucks, which I know is a little bit pricier for a jacket, but if you think about like how much you spend on a pair of jeans, I think that this is so worth it. So definitely check out a Levi's outlet store or if you have one near you. Um, but yeah, love this piece. Okay, so this is the second to last jacket and I got this just last night. This is a jacket that I've been wanting a ton for years and I just never knew if I should invest like hundreds of dollars and get a really expensive one or if I should just get the trend, try it out, see if I like it. So it's this um, Shein teddy bear jacket. And for me, this is one of those items that's either super expensive or it's super inexpensive. For me, at least, I either want to spend a lot of money and get a really nice one or I don't really want to spend that much money at all. It's a great color for me. It's very warm and brown and camely. Again, this is a size large from Shein. I'll leave the link to this exact one down below. It's got these huge pockets, which I love. You could just slip your arms right in. I wanted to wear this jacket when I'm going traveling and I need a really big fuzzy jacket or if I'm just going on a quick weekend trip in the winter. I think a jacket like this is definitely a more cozy, like no makeup, leggings and a black top with some running shoes. Like I think that's the kind of outfit I envisioned when I got this jacket, but then also 
like if it's really cold one day I think a really cute pair of Levi's with a black shirt just like what I'm wearing today would be really cute with like a crossbody bag to give it a little bit more shape so uh, again this was like $35 or something like that so really inexpensive for a jacket like this feels really good in the inside because it's lined um, so it's not super scratchy or anything I will say that this feels not the softest it's not like the most incredible feeling in the entire world but uh, and it does shed a little bit there's like a little bit of shedding everywhere it's really cute to just get the look and it's worth it for me for the price point for my very last coat she's coming back she's coming back for this year too I mean I'm not in Michigan anymore but I had to show off my duvet H&M jacket this jacket just came with me everywhere on my Europe trip um, I bought it in I forgot what city I bought it in I think I bought it in Amsterdam um, but I I got this in a size 6 I hope H&M does this jacket again it was such a hit I literally was like on campus, I was the girl that wore the orange jacket. I love this jacket so, so, so much, and I really want to wear it again this year, but I'm going to be in Los Angeles, and it hasn't yet dropped anywhere below, like, 75 degrees. I I'm going to have to wait till it's, like, the butt crack of winter, like, till we're in the deep winter depths. Um, to pull this guy out, but I just, I love her so much. She just has so many good memories, especially because I wore this all around my Europe trip, and I wore this and then another coat on top. That's how cold it was. But again, love this jacket to pieces. I really want to make a trip out to Vancouver or New York this winter. It's just two places that I really want to go. I haven't been in a while to New York and um, Vancouver. I've never been before and I have a ton of friends up there. So I just, I feel like this is just like the perfect piece to wear out there. Anyways. So that is everything. That is all the jackets and coats that I have to show you today. I want to be pushing out all of these fall videos now so that later in October and November I can do my Vlogtober and I can also do um, more fall morning routines and more fall videos that you guys probably want to see. Um, right now in Los Angeles it's not that cold so I wanted to do all of these kinds of videos so that we can keep preparing for fall um, and I'm just really excited again that fall is here but with that i think that's everything i have to say you guys i think a fuzz from that jacket went into my nose because my nose is so itchy but i hope you guys enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up if you did if you learned something new it helps me out a ton again if you haven't subscribed already please subscribe down below so i hope you guys are having a great rest of your day i will talk to you guys all on saturday's video and i'll see you soon bye